Hi Sagittarius and welcome to your tarot love messages here. As always guys, these messages are general, so please just keep that in mind. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here. So these messages are intended for Sagittarius Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those cross-watching. Let's take a look and see what messages are coming in for you here. We have the star card, the six of wands, and the three of pentacles, the two of wands, the eight of swords, and the three of cups. Wow. Okay. Um, first and foremost, I feel like there's something really big happening for you here. Um, I feel like for a lot of you, there's going to be um, a movement in, pos in a, um, a positive movement in the right direction. So for those of you that... Um, a single and looking for love I feel like you're you're putting yourself in the way of love and I feel like you're attracting and manifesting someone extremely special here someone whom you know who possesses the traits and the admirable uh, characteristics and um, qualities that you seek in an ideal partner so someone whom I feel like and uh, yeah the idea you're manifesting and attracting this ideal partner um, this beautiful energy into your life for those of you that are in a relationship I feel like there is going to be some confirmation and some validation that you are on the right path with this individual for some of you you may be going through something and maybe all you're seeking is a sign maybe this is it maybe this is the sign that you want I don't know but I feel like there may be signs or evidence that show up whether this week or around this week here which feel like they're validating or confirming what you feel or they are the signs that you are so desperately wanting to receive. Um, you could also be receiving some sort of dream which I feel like um, will provide you with validation or confirmation of this person or that you are on the right path. I'm also, see I'm also seeing that some of you here Sagittarius are going through some healing and I feel like the things that you have been going through in the last couple of months, you may not have realized, but they have not weakened you. In fact, they have strengthened you. And I feel like you're coming out on the other end. Something he has... I feel like you felt as though it brought you to your knees. You felt as though you've hit emotional rock bottom because of this person or what they've done to you or how they've hurt you or the, because of the disrespect they've shown you or because of certain unfortunate events that have unfolded for you. You, you feel as though this very thing has brought you to your knees and stripped you of everything you've had. But you don't understand, Sagittarius, because I feel like some of you have literally, it cleansed you, okay? It cleansed you. And sometimes when you hit rock bottom, the only way up, the only way you know out is up so it's strengthened you it's made you that much more resilient uh, it's made you that much more stronger and I feel like you're coming back from something you're healing a hurt or a situation you're healing yourself you're healing um, some past trauma here and you're coming back stronger you're coming back so much stronger and healthier and whatever it is that you've went through, it's changed you. It's changed you. It's prepared you for the things that are coming for you. It's prepared you for these challenges here. Now, I feel like there is an energy around you. For those of you that are like in a romantic connection here, I feel like there's an energy around you who feels extremely blessed to have you in their lives. This person is someone who admires you a lot. They have a lot of respect for you. They put you up on a pedestal. This is someone who I feel like is in awe of you. Okay, They may not tell you, but I feel like it's important that you know. Now, Six of Wands tells me there is some sort of movement, some sort of positive direction, some sort of positive developments happening in terms of love. Um, things are taking a turn for... Um, for the better here, I feel like you're either going to receive some sort of uplifting news or something Something that someone says might really put you in a really good place 
I feel like there's something positive here, something successful and positive. Um, some of you, I feel like, are entering a very successful and very healthy and loving relationship. For others of you, I feel like you're on the right path. Keep going, keep trotting along this path because it's going to lead you to success, love, abundance here. Um, okay, now I'm seeing that with the Three of Pentacles, I feel like there is uh, the message that the Three of Pentacles has for you. Um, I feel like there is someone around you whom you need to... I feel like this, this, I don't know who this person is, but it feels like maybe they are a connecting energy, maybe this is a professional, but I feel like there is someone around you who can offer you some really solid advice. Some of you, I feel like I'm getting that you feel a little bit lost or you feel as though um, you need some guidance or you need some advice here. It could be, it could be one of, you could be reaching out to, you know, one of your favorite tarot readers here. You could be reaching out to some sort of um, professional, so it feels like a, uh, maybe it's a psychologist or um, a counselor here it could be a good friend it could be someone who served as a mentor to you um, it could be someone that you may not even know all that well but I feel like this person offers you some really solid advice and maybe it's this person that's going to put you on this right path or to put you on the path where you should be on I feel like somehow they have a helping hand in your journey here. Now, with the two of wands, some of you I feel like are going to be connecting with someone online. You're going to be connecting with someone online. So some of you I feel like maybe are a little bit hesitant about what is it? Is it joining some sort of dating app or is it putting yourself out there, putting your information out there? You know, or is it being vulnerable and actually putting yourself out there? Um, I feel like some of you are a little bit hesitant here, but don't be because I feel like the rewards plenty what's to come of this will be so worth it so if you've been wanting to you know join a dating app or um, get, um, get social and start getting connected with people you will be connecting with someone extremely special is what I'm seeing here okay some of you also feel like are going to be in a long-term relationship even maybe by by this week or by the end of the month here some of you, I feel like, are going to find yourselves in a long-term relationship here. Or is it you having to decide between something and a long-term relationship for some of you? I feel like maybe you're talking with someone overseas or in a different country, in a different city, state from yourself. And I feel like this person is wanting... It's like almost they're, they're not demanding... But I feel like they're wanting to know whether you're actually committed to making this work. It's not they're not questioning your uh, your loyalty. Um, they're questioning whether you choose them or this other thing. Because I feel like it's some sort of decision that you're going to have to make with regards to the future here. Um, the Eight of Swords. There is someone here around you. Uh, who I feel like, look, maybe it's your energy, but I feel like someone may be playing a bit of a uh, self-victimization uh, mentality here. Because I feel like someone here is, there's a lot of self-entrapment with this card. So someone here, I feel like, is, the reason why they're stuck in the situation is not because there is no way out. There is a way out. There's like eight different ways out of this situation. But this person is refusing to see a way out because... On some level, they're uncomfortable. They're comfortable in this uncomfortable situation. I'm just gonna repeat that again. Whether it's yourself or a connecting energy, I feel like if it's a connecting energy, you're wanting to help this person. It could be a romantic energy. It could be someone around you here. You keep wanting to rescue or help this person. This person, they need to rescue themselves because they keep be playing the victim here and they feel like there's no way out of the situation there is a way out but they get they're getting a little bit too comfortable in their uncomfortable situation so they're scared to leave their comfort zone here now say yes to any upcoming um social gatherings because i feel like they're going to be um, extremely important for you for some of you i feel like maybe you you will likely to meet someone special um, so if you have any like upcoming um, events such as weddings and engagements here, be sure to RSVP and attend because I feel like you will either connect with someone extremely special 
or I feel like you will go on to have in um, a very memorable time a very uh, I'm seeing a lot of merriment a lot of drinking a lot of um, dancing um, and that's what you need I feel like you need to put yourself out there here some of you watching this I feel like that's exactly what you need you need to let your hair down here you need to celebrate some of you, you will be having reason to celebrate because I feel like someone very close to you is getting engaged here. Yeah. They're getting engaged or they're going to share news that they may be expecting a child or planning a wedding or an engagement here. And they want you to be a part of this. So like maybe a bridesmaid or a groomsman here. So I feel like you're, there's reason to celebrate here. Okay, guys, that is all I have for you t um, this week. Thank you, guys, um, for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to the channel, liking, commenting, sharing. Um, I will be sharing with you more tarot love readings, so stay tuned. Thanks, guys, again, and bye for now.